Hey everyone, Cubic King 77 here from the ACS team here to do a review video of the OICS ROM on your Nexus S4G. It is another ice cream sandwich port, Android 4.0. It is from Source and uh, well, from what I've heard, it's very good. This is definitely the ice cream sandwich ROM I recommend you flashing on your Nexus S4G. I do recommend wiping data when installing this. I'm not doing a how-to video. I can link to another how-to video of wiping data, but all you have to do is go ahead and go into Clockwork, wipe data, cache, and Delvic cache, and install this ROM, and you're good to go. Uh, this is the start screen, but anyways, if you do want to install this ROM, you can click on the link in the description, and it'll take you to a download link. Big, big shout out and thanks to AOSP developer. Uh, he has developed for the Hero, Optimus V, and Sensation. So he's now developing for the Nexus S4G, thankfully. So uh, definitely be sure to give him a thanks and shout out. So big thanks to him. As you can see, the OICS ROM right there. And download link is actually right there. So download link's right there. And as you can see right away, working incoming MMS. I know that has been something that has been working on a lot of the source ports. Now, he's got it working, awesome. So download that zip, put it on your internal storage, no need to unzip it or anything, and you're good to go. Wipe and install. And now, I'm gonna go ahead and do a review video of it. So as you can see, phone just booted up, I'm on the start screen, I'm gonna go ahead and start. And I'm going to, let's see what happens when I hit activate. So I guess it's gonna program my phone, so I'm gonna go ahead and not make you guys sit through this. Okay, so now it says phone is activated. So, not sure exactly what that did. 3G was working before. I'm not gonna set anything up so you don't have to watch me. Just kinda of letting you uh, set this up. I'm gonna go ahead and type in my name real quick. Okay, and should be on the last screen now, finish. And here we go. So. We are good to go. Now running the OICS ROM on your Nexus S4G. As you can see right away, you got the ice cream sandwich live wallpaper background, my favorite live wallpaper by far. So everything, I mean everything pretty much works. You got Google Wallet working, you've got, you've got GPS working. As you can see, wallet's right there. It works just fine. So awesome, definitely the ice cream sandwich ROM that I recommend for your Nexus S4G. So huge thanks to AOSP for getting all this working. And GPS works. I'm gonna go ahead and open up Maps and then see if it can get a lock. I'm inside right now, obviously. So we'll see up at the top if, come on, focus. So hopefully the uh, little blinking icon will get a lock. I actually haven't used GPS on any ice cream sandwich ROM before. So it definitely locked. Awesome, I'm even inside and it got a lock. So great, definitely something that's a big issue with old ice cream sandwich ROMs is your mat, your GPS not working, but now it is, and so is incoming MMS, uh, picture messaging incoming, and I, outcom outgoing MMS should work just fine. So definitely awesome. I'm gonna go to settings, go down to about phone, and scroll down a little more. As you can see, Android version 4.0.1. Awesome. And it, as you can see, um, he included the Franco kernel. So it's got a custom kernel as well, in case you were wondering about that. So everything, everything should be running fast and smooth. I believe he added some widgets as well. Let's see if he added any apps. Yeah, he added some apps as well that um, to this ROM, so definitely added some things to check out. Otherwise, he added some widgets as well. Obviously, you got all the stock widgets, and then you should get some other newer ones that you haven't seen before. Um, I haven't noticed any out of the ordinary as of now. I'm sure maybe, hmm, I was told there were newer widgets. I guess not, I'm not seeing any. No big deal, it's not like it matters to me, these widgets are all awesome on Ice Cream Sandwich, but stock, I believe, actually, the Talk app, Google Talk, the video chat works really well, too, on this port, so that's definitely something else to check out. Very awesome 
really great. I mean, everything seems to be smooth, snappy, running very well. Let's go ahead and make sure data works, which it does. So, should take me right to Google. There you go. 3G worked real well. Everything's working great. So definitely, so oh, camcorder. That's another thing, forgot. Let's go to the camera app real quick. All right, takes me to the camera app, as you can see. So let's go ahead and try and take a picture. Okay, took a picture very easily. Now I'm gonna switch it to camcorder. So right here, you press the bottom right and then you select camcorder. Now let's take a look and see if I can record. Recording. There you have it. Awesome. Stop. Awesome. Let's go ahead and try and play it real quick. So play. Sweet. Video playback works as well. There you have it. Awesome. <laughs> so there you go. Everything seems to be working real great. I'm definitely gonna be running this on my Nexus S4 G for a while. Finally got everything working, so should be good to go then. If you do have any questions at all, any trouble installing this ROM, have any questions, feel free to ask. Leave a comment on the video, I'll be happy to help you guys out. Be sure to let me know what you think of this as well. Leave a comment on the video letting me know. Be happy to hear from you guys. Be sure to subscribe as well for future videos. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Links in the description of the video, and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Thanks for watching.